Hello, welcome to the channel. <laughs> Truck spotting. It's a truck spotting video. Uh, where's he going? He's going there. Right, it's a truck spotting video. Bonnie Scotland tree surgery and landscape. Uh. 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 Oh, that's quite long, that actually. All right. Not that long. It's not that fucking long. Um, God sake, what a fucking mess. This. Oh. Oh, fucking hell. It's always hard to know where to go. Um, so I've got, I've got my bag. Don't need me sunglasses. Uh, that's quite. You'd have to know to park there, wouldn't you? Probably work here or something, wouldn't you? Oh, look at this truck coming in. We've got a big truck coming in. Yes. Um, uh, so we're going to have to... Yes. Oh, going into the... It's a, one of the horse things. thought I was getting lucky there. Oh, pops and bangs. It's dark o'clock. Dark o'clock. <sighs> I don't think we're going to get much trucks Sunday night. Can't kind of see it. We have just seen a big bus though. We need the mole catcher. Like everything else though, we got rid of the mole catcher. Get rid of everything. Uh, this means that. Hmm? AA15. I 
thing when you do this sort of videoing is that well, it's also difficult to know what to film. Really, I'm looking for trucks, but I'm not going to get many, any at all. Well, there is some about, but. Data, mutant poultry. Alright, taking a left there. That was a bit incompetent. In the wrong lane. That's nice. It's all very, very nice. Um, it's quite an interesting pothole there. Right there. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting pool. <sighs> and we got a truck here. We got a truck. Is that a bus or a truck? It's a truck. It's a gritter. Are they expecting frost? Wow. Gonna be cold tonight. Really? Oh well. I don't think it's going to be cold tonight. Uh, it might be. Right, let's go back to the car. Get out of here. Yeah. How long does it take for them to fill their bloody... Chrysler 300 Right, I'll film this blue thing coming out and then and then we'll get going. Caution, vehicle reversing. I thought it stuck there for a minute. It did stick, didn't it? This fucking thing. It'll just be like it. It did that to me with a train. I wanted to film a train and it fucking froze. I wonder if it has something to do with that zoom her in button. Here we go. We're off. Yeah. 
Wow. Yeah, this was like, you've got to take your time out, you've got a horse in the back, you know? You kind of just sort of go flying onto the road, can you? Uh, really. It makes sense to drive carefully, you know? Absolutely, yeah. Absolutely. You absolutely have to. Oh, wow. Uh, film done a potato. I don't know. I could, see, the thing is, a lot of wood I pick up from a log burner. Hmm. The bits that are sort of lying around have been blown off in the wind, and generally, um, some more way down there. Generally, it might be a bit rotten, you know. <sighs> Free heat. Don't listen to the government. Don't listen to these parasites. Government parasites. All they want to do is make you poor. It's the only thing they've got in mind. And it lies. It's cheating. Nonsense. They're bad people. They're bad. Uh -huh. Oh look, somebody's been up here and there. What the hell's this? It's uh, paving slabs. Uh, so we got one, two, four, five trucks. I think we'll leave them be. Um, don't let me hassle them too much. I do like spotting trucks, but it's, they're working and they're trying to get a bit of peace. So, you know. I am not a not a, well, I am a nurse, but I'm not a total psycho. I do understand people need a bit of privacy, a bit of a rest. And maybe someone wouldn't mind talking to you, truck spotter. Who knows? You know? Oh, there's a path there. I didn't realise there's a path there. <coughs> a truck spotter. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's an horse stick there. Uh, I'll have that one as well. Right, that's it, I'm going now. We're going. Definitely going. Get in the car and go. Ooh, fucking tripped up.
Words like Valum, the earthen ramrod uh, that marks the line of Hadrian's wall at this point as it crosses the river in Carlisle. Uh, we've just come over the bridge, we've got the river Eden sort of rushing away below us. How did you find out something was here? I mean, sorry, it's so unprepossessing. So, so we look the opposite way and we look at the cricket club. Very nice. See the green signs by the doors? Yes. They were underwater. Okay. City was underwater. Give us the year. 2015. So go on, what happens next? We were starting to plan to move the pavilion over here. And um, because the Valen runs over the other side of the, the cricket club, we had to have an archaeological dig. They called on the services of Frank Gico of Wardle Armstrong, director of the Uncovering Roman Carlisle project. I asked him what we were going to do. It was a four day dig. He said, We're going to do a trench here, we're going to do a trench here, we're going to do a trench here, we're going to do one there. And I went to work, we have to find something spectacular. Or nothing at all. Nothing in the middle. And he did find the spectacular. I mean, the biggest is. building on the whole of Adrian's wall. It's a pain at times, but when you see things coming out and they are actually digging, it's fantastic. Fantastic enough to hit the headlines locally and nationally. Within the huge building, probably two storeys high, were baths, a drainage system, and an underfloor heated room or hypercaust, with the floor seated on tiles stamped with the imperial monogram IMP, Imperator. The theory is that the Imperator, or Emperor in question, was Septimius Severus, who is recorded to have been in Britain in the early 3rd century with his Syrian wife, Julia Domna. In the shelter of a company warehouse, site manager Frank Gico unwrapped one of the most dramatic finds for me, uh. one of two carved stone heads about half a metre high. These are blank staring features and it's clearly a female, isn't it? We were scratching our heads when we first thought it. We thought, is it a representation of the emperor and the empress and all this, or is it a god? But now more and more people looked at it and now we're, we're pretty comfortable with the idea that it's... It's a representation of a theatre mask. So you see them with a the mouth wow. wide open yeah, and the big can. eyes. It was to allow the audience serious. from a distance to see exactly what you were representing. I Are don't get that at all. Bath house that we did on The outside of this building. Really? Right, so can you see evidence of no shit. weathering on there? There or? is some weathering. It may have been painted. It's all built for somebody very important. We have a dedication inscription to Julia Domna, the wife of the emperor. Septimus Severus. We know the Imperial Court was in York. We also know he visited Carlisle. It's documented. He was campaigning in Scotland. So yeah. over the heads, we've got this very special building. Because. So all these things together make you think, well, maybe it was built for, in effect, a royal visit. So should we uh, think maybe of Carlisle? I say, I think you could be on to something here. Severus is here. It's almost like. And we talk about we get traffic lights up here, this is not a good choice. must smell of fresh paint. Yeah. Um, everyone doing it up. Totally it's red. We've got this very strange building. It's cars parked in front I'm of it. Because I'm stopping really calling it a bathhouse. You know, it's a very posh uh, building that had heated rooms. Not for and would have had a suite of baths. Uh, but it isn't a bathhouse. It's a house with a bath. So a more modern function, really, is what we think of. Uh, Rather so than, say, bath. going to the swimming pool or the sauna. Well, why don't I just spa, follow that car there? You've got a nice bathroom. I mean, it's going. I think in the Roman you know. world, everybody oh, bathed, but how quickly that became oh, look, true it's, it's, for Northern it's England, it's I'm not sure. It's changed to green. Professor Elizabeth Archibald it's has changed. made a study it's changed of the green. bathing yep. as it developed it through the Roman and medieval yep. periods. It's changed. After two or three hundred years of Roman yep. Did you see it change into green? Given that I've seen it change into green. It changed to fucking green. Too, I assume, unless you were a shepherd way out on the moors, you've never seen a Roman. Look, green, that's red there. And it looks as if people who weren't Roman soldiers joined in. The temporary traffic lights. Imagine, what is it, ritual bathing or 
social it's not me. What's going on in my these cousin. I met my cousin all the day. Went away in my car. We built. Oh, I think it's large. Cousin, I met at home bargains. It's relaxing and it's of health and I'm, giving. I'm and my cousin. I, but no, no, I'm not me. I'm you. Community centres. I'm went there them. In bigger cities. My cousin, went there to cousin, then. People do I always business. Always wanted a certain. Lovers get picked she up. Stole my certain. Bumped me over the head. It took my certain. And I think we can assume. Here I am. In it. I'm uh, the result of 500 years of evolution of the Macbeth family. And look what's happened to us. Look at the state of us. Fucked up. Fucked up and totally fucked. With no future and no hope. And sore legs, sore back. All I do is constantly arrange car faults to get repaired. Uh, go around fucking falling out of corners. That's all my life because so. I'm going to come up here tomorrow because I've got a problem. I've got a problem with my my lower part. That's below. I have I have a problem. There's something not quite right and it's causing an infection of some type. Uh, what else is wrong with me? Uh, I've got to go up. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah. The cut in, so if you would have like a, a wax yeah. seal, you would push it on to leave your mark. So the official documents you never see. Yeah, my videos are crap, aren't they? Yes. 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 Well, I hope you enjoyed that. I didn't. It was crap. There's no, there's no point. I'm just going to go home and sit down in front of the fire. Thanks for watching. Oh, I always wanted to go into that car wash in there. Bang!